escape building. Yes. Okay. You're gonna need to go up the elevator as well. Okay. So as soon as you hit a pound, you're gonna hit all right thank you sir hey guys this is justin from grimes find uh bought four units yesterday anyway we're just going to bring you along on the journey uh we are at one uh quick up to speed my wife kind of gets ahead of me she goes around pays for the units gets the new locks i have spare keys and anyway we just popped this door open i have not touched anything in this unit um so now we're gonna find out what's in here. I'll give you kind of real quick why I bought the unit, why I do this every time. So real quick, when I haven't poked the box, I wanted to poke the box, but I saw this uh, iMac box in here. So I'm hoping it's in there. Probability is it's probably not, but if it's in there, I paid $460 for this unit. So let's find out what we got. All right, guys, so again, I have not touched this box. I'm just gonna poke it. Okay, so I'm already out there. Uh, one other thing I noticed real quick when I popped this open, there's an iPad box in here. It's probably not gonna be in there either. But, uh, no, it's empty. That's all right. Yeah, nothing in there. Real quick, looks like some knee pads. Looks like a Texas fan. Portable scale. Uh, let's see what else we got here. Uh, pictures. Oh, that's kind of. You know, part of this job is kind of. It's, it's almost kind of sad. You wonder why these people lost this stuff. Um, but anyways, picture of a lady. I'm not going to show her face on here, but getting baptized. Um, so you just kind of always wonder what happened. Anyway, nothing really too phenomenal in that box. That's empty. Got golf clubs here. Top flight, like top flight security off next Friday. Uh, looks like we got some camping bags. Hey, maybe they won the lottery and the money's in here. Uh, so we've got some yard equipment. And so we're not gonna take this up out of the unit today. Uh, my guys will be out with the truck tomorrow. Uh, I just can't help myself. I gotta get here and know what we got. So it looks like a drummer seat, uh, more yard equipment, uh, maybe some video and stuff, a little plug and play. Nothing exciting in there. I do see baseball, basketball cards up here. Uh, so I'm hoping those are in there. So it looks like we got a tuba. Looks like a it's an Acer. Maybe a little high speed. Uh oh, somebody got in trouble. Texas Department of Public Safety. Just a citation. Speeding. Slow down, lady. All right. So we got a laptop. Looks like we got. Let's see what we got here. Hey, it's from my era. It's a Chronic 2001. Weezer. Ludicrous. Man, it looks like third day dashboard confessions. This is all stuff from when I was younger. Third day. Anyway, cool. Yeah, a little box of CDs. It'll bring in 10 or 20 bucks. All right, box, boxes. Uh, here's what the box looks like before I dig in it. Got some common basketball cards. Tony Parker. Not a big fan of the Saints. Um, this stuff I'm not going to open now, but I do. Like I said, I go through all these, make sure there's not money left in them. Uh, let's see. Oh, here you go. A little Winchester knife. Nice. Let's see. Mm, it's been sharpened. Uh, it's been sharpened badly, but it's a limited edition. Uh, a 3030. Yeah, it's okay shape. Looking forward, you'll be able to bid on it. Pictures. Don't want to show their faces. Let's see what else we got here. Um, some kind of electronic device. Not sure what that is. Snooze. A little thing. Pictures. David Robinson. Oh, here's some baseball cards. Let's see what's in here. It looks like a little grab pack, so there's probably not going to be any, you know, rare cards in here. Nolan. Oh, Nolan Ryan's. Let's see. 
not worth anything. These are all common, known runs. 1967 is his rookie year. We've sold several of those. Uh, it's a good card. Uh, let's see, Monopoly. Quick trip. Oh, that's what that timer went to. So, you know, anything Monopoly. Uh, real quick. Oh, well, at least they're using protection, I guess. That's good. Okay, here's a... Oh, it's a watch band. So it looks like in here we've got just some general decor. Stuff like that will sell. Nothing exciting. More condoms, which I'm married. I don't need. Um, okay, dishes. Nothing exciting. I'll set this right here. Bag. Oops, heavy. Oh, it's not close. Maybe board games. Nope. So, let's see what we've got in here. We've got a little speaker system. And a little HDMI. Oh, it's a big DVD player. Anyway, not going to pull that out. That's probably like $40, $50 bag. Over there. Huh? Yeah, here's the sub to it. Um, so, again... I didn't spend a lot on this. Not too worried. Random tools, tool brushes. Oh, I've actually wanted one of these. <laughs> I'm gonna hook this up at the house. One of those remote control Christmas lights on the outside of the house. So I, I'm gonna take that with me today. I'm gonna put that outside. All right. So, little box feels like maybe. I have no idea what this is. Okay, more pictures. Okay, maybe this person worked at QT. Here's another uh, 50. Oh. Blur all that out. We just want to be respectful. Uh, anyway. Now I'm starting to guess this is the second QT anniversary thing, so I'm starting to think uh, maybe they worked for the corporate office of QT or something. So anyway, that's kind of cool. Uh, anyway, this is a uh, personal photo. It's not going to show those. Okay. Okay. Here's what I like. Hey, look. <laughs> okay. So look, check this out. It's not your regular dollar bill. Uh, this is a 1957B silver certificate. So not a regular dollar, it's probably worth that condition five bucks, five, ten bucks. But that's a good sign. Nope. It's used cracked cell phone. Uh, Apple charger, actually I need that. Uh, still older one, more QT stuff, so, oh. Okay, so absolutely they had to work for QT because here's one of the anniversary uh, pins. A lot of the time, these are only 10 karat gold filled. Uh, yep. So it says uh, 1 tenth 10K, so it's just gold filled. And I'm not sure there's a big market for uh, QT collectibles yet. Maybe one day. So we'll keep that in there when we come back. So we've got some iPod shuffle. Oh, I think it's in there. Oh. No, I guess just the charger and stuff. But hopefully, this dude liked Apple. Looks like he kept it, or the young lady. No, that's that's the iPod. This is? That's the iPod. That's the actual iPod? Yeah. It's for oh. working out and stuff. Oh, crap. Huh. I don't know electronics very well. But hey, it's in there. So cool. Let's see what kind of music they got on when we get back. Probably some more Dr. Dre. Oh, I need this. Heck yeah, I always need these. So, nothing in that drawer. Nothing in that one. Okay. Kitchen utensils. Believe it or not, this stuff sells. Okay, pretty cool. We got a box of DVDs. Looks like several of them are still new in the packages. Entourage. Uh, let's see what else they got in here. Looks like they liked Entourage. But anyway, so box of DVDs. Okay, these are springs. It's just a box of springs. Uh, 
to a trampoline, looks like. Trampoline's in the seat right now. Oh, sure is. <laughs> Look at this. And there's the frame. Oh, and there's the frame. My kids wanted a trampoline, no lie. And we just moved from Heath to Plano. And so now I got a spot to put that. Got a nice little grill here. Oh, he's got it tied shut. He's gonna see if it was clean. Camping chairs. He's got a couple more there. We'll make a lot of those. Actually, a new company moved in next to ours, and uh, they were looking for office chairs. So I'm gonna gift this to our neighbors. Okay. Uh, yoga mat. Let me see, it's miscellaneous, not, not, nothing big. It's got some weight in it. Uh, it's like personal papers, bills, uh, some clothing. American Eagle, I just, I like to look at the brands. Some of these old jeans will sell pretty well. American Eagle. Looks like they're American Eagle fan. Uh, okay, here's the subwoofer to the sound system we already found. Looks like just a little workbench. Oh, uh, yeah. It's got extension. Reel it. This looks like a new uh, steamer. Clean, better, chemical free. Uh, oh, steam is cleaner. So it is brand new. So new steamer. This. Okay, so we got a uh, rock band set. It looks like. It's all in here. It's just been disassembled. So that's good. Good little find. Wish we had the Xbox to go with it. Okay. Let's see. I was kind of curious what these are. This looks like it might be some kind of either flooring. I don't know. Maybe some kind of something to reduce sound and. Echo nothing in there, personal papers. Uh, looks like we had some beats, but they're gone. Wow, that would have been nice to find. Which one's that? 128 gig iPhone box. Oh, more QT stuff. Oh, I gotta put the business on there, but let's see. I was right. Quick Trip Corporation. And uh, facilities support manager. Okay. Nothing down these box. More empty electronic boxes. Oh, James Avery. James Avery always sells well. Dang it. Oh, uh, got a watch clasp. So that's empty. Yeah, and I hope the extra light, guys, we've uh, upgraded some of our equipment. Uh, we're just going to get better and better at this, so I hope you can see better than you could in episode one. Anyway, so down in here, cordless grill. Oh, there's the Xbox charger. Uh, just some random miscellaneous cell phones, Blackberry, stuff like that. Nothing too exciting. And then, like I said, we got the barbecue grill with frame. A little bit more. Uh, probably needs a new battery. Um, but I think, guys, for this unit, that's it. Uh, but again, I think 460 spent. The Schwinn bike's real nice. It's clean, needs air in the tires. Grill. Uh, Alright, looks like we're getting to the end of the unit, so I'm hoping we find something spectacular. 
is not a bag. Which is nice. I'm sell this. Okay, here we go. Okay, this is still a nice Swiss Army bag. Chargers. Okay, what do we got here? Hey, look. It's older, but it's kind of cool, man. This older Apple stuff is collectible. It sells. And we've got the charger in here for it. So, it's just kind of cool, you know, but the stuff's collectible. So, older MacBook. So, just set this down. Oh, QT bag. And we go through all this stuff better when we get back to the paper, stuff like that. Make sure we didn't miss anything. Money, cash, gold, silver. There's something in here I kind of want to see. More QT. Oh. oh, that'd be nice, wouldn't it? Yeah, so nothing really much in it. It's not a good luggage, it's still nice. I've got this tub left. Ah, here we go. Come on, baby. Come on, baby. Please be in here. Please be in here. I just... Damn. But these boxes are so heavy, it's like misleading every time. Okay, so nothing in there. Let's just get this out. Uh, personal stuff. Keep that off camera. Paper shredder. Okay, so these might be neat. These look used. Obviously, we saw a drum, uh, the drum seat. Guitar Hero. I've got several friends that are big musicians who I'll ask if these are worth anything. They may not be. I kept all the electronics. So, Beats Padre. I wish these were in here. Not feeling like they are. Not a. Okay, we got a Wii Sport. I'm hoping this is in it. It's not. <laughs> Shoebox. It's nice and heavy. Hold on, guys. This is just all pers personal stuff, pictures. this stuff over. This so we got magazines, newspapers, books, personal stuff. The heck is that? Some kind of file filing. Not sure what it's for. We'll look that up later. Um, empty. So, all right. So this is one of those units where I know I'll make money on, but I did not find anything spectacular. I'll have the guys move the mattresses tomorrow. Hopefully, maybe there's something cool hidden behind there. But uh, we made money on this unit, but it definitely wasn't uh, wasn't a big score. All right, guys. So we're done with this unit for today. Uh, just a quick recap. One of the reasons why I bought this unit was because of the iMac. Uh, box was empty. Uh, we did find a lot of other electronics in here that I didn't originally see when I bought the unit and it was a bust. They were all empty. Uh, I'll still make a little bit of money on the unit, uh, but nothing major. If you want to see the items in this unit in more detail, look at the comments below and there'll be a link to where you can view those items individually. Um, and please just follow our YouTube, Facebook, and Instagram pages and we'll see you next time.